Hello, this is Seher from Easy Beasy, and the topic that we are going to discuss today is called as what are mutations. The mutation can be defined as a permanent change in the sequence of a DNA fragment or a gene. Now this mutation is also present in RNA during the process of transcription and it can be present in protein during the process of translation but RNA and protein is present in our body for a certain period of time. And after that, they will get degraded by different enzymes and by different exonucleases. So our body will suffer that disease for a certain period of time, but after that we will recover from that disease and will feel better. Okay, so the main reason for the mutation is a DNA, not the RNA and the protein. Now there are a lot of different causes for mutations inside the gene. The main causes are radiations, the chemical that we ingest, and the infectious agent that attacks our body and produces different types of disease. Now DNA mutations can be of two different types. If the mutation is present in the coding region of the DNA, then it is called as coding gene mutation. Coding genes are basically going to code for messenger RNA and this messenger RNA will affect the protein from it. The other type of DNA mutations can be present in the non-coding area of the DNA and it is called as non-coding genes mutation. Now these mutations can be present in the regulatory part of the DNA which is controlling the amount of protein that needs to get synthesized and it is also present at the attenuator site where the process of transcription will end. So if the mutation is present in that region that will come under the category of non-coding genes and if they are going to transcribe and translate into a protein and that protein is affected by it then it will be called as the coding gene mutations. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like it please subscribe this channel. Thank you. Bye bye.